I S U P K. Yo. What are the bumble clap to them, boy, man? Bad mind, I'm gonna kill them. Suffocate on a pussy wall. Yo, status. Tell some boys we don't chat us. Anyway, my dog go in on the street, them bad. Gun talking on my jeans, member. If any somebody ever treat them bad, send the pussy them, but meet them God. Louis me kick, pan we feed them bad. Catch a new drip, dog, we beat them bad. Look how we just come and we a beat them bad. You know, sister, we is them dad. Hey, but anyway, though, this are no playground. The Glock 19, they have to stay round. Now nah, take no check with my payroll. Anything rise up, play down. They must send check, but they won't. Dark, we will make it step if they don't. But at the same old, same old. Said them want smoke, but they grab a ton flame out. A couple of yalla come true. Yes, yeah, Shalom Israel. We are the ISUPK. Out of One West, 125th Street. Harlem, New York, under commanding General Yohanna. We've been teaching the truth according to the Bible since 1969 that the so-called black man, native Indian man, and Hispanic man are of the 12 lowest tribes of the children of Israel. That's right. All right. And today, we're going to continue bringing you the truth according to the Bible. Because since the coronavirus, since all these uprisings that the scriptures have said, there will be wars, there will be rumors of wars. Nation is going to rise against nation, kingdom against kingdom. And the so-called black man is just falling prey to all these circumstances and situations because the so-called black man does not know who we are according to the Bible. Right. All right, This Bible was given to the so-called black man to make him understand who he is. Who is the so-called black man today? The so-called black man is a separate man, a separate man from all other people and all other races that are on the face of the earth. Right. Sorry. All right. Um, give me the full script there. Yeah. The book of First Peter chapter, chapter, the book of Second Peter chapter one and verse twenty. Knowing this verse, that no prophecy of the scripture is of any private interpretation. Now this is the first thing that the so-called black man. Native Indian man and Hispanic man must understand that no scripture in this Bible is of any private interpretation. Right. This Bible is not to pick up and go in a corner and read it and say, well, all right, this is me and my pastor. This is not a private book. This book is a book that was given to a nation of people. And that nation of people is the nation of Israel. Right. All right, read on. Verse 21. For the prophecy came not in all time by the will of man, these prophecies and these words, according to the scriptures, was not given by what? By an all time by the will of man. It was not given by the will of man. But read on. But holy men of the Most High spake as they were moved but, by the Holy Spirit. But who? But holy men of, of the Most High right. spake. But holy men of the Most High power. Holy men, which means in the Hebrew, separate men, black men, Hispanic men, native Indian men were given these scriptures, read on. But holy men of the Most High spake as they were moved by the Holy Spirit. As they were moved by the Holy Spirit. And the so-called black man must understand when you read this scripture that the Bible was given to you by your forefathers. Right. The East Indians did not write this Bible. The Chinese and the Japanese did not write this Bible. That's right. The so-called white man does not write this Bible. That's right. The Africans did not write this Bible. This Bible belongs to the Israelites, the so-called black man, native Indian man, and Hispanic man today. That's right. right. Alright. The so-called black man is not an African. Right. The culture of the so-called black man is in these scriptures. Right. Passover. That's right. Hanukkah. The feast of, un of unle unleavened bread. Right. This is the culture of the so-called black man. This culture in the Bible is what is going to take the so-called black man, native Indian man, and Hispanic man out of the ghetto. Right. You so-called black man cannot follow the culture of the Africans because you are not African. Right. So-called black man. Right. Washing your face with cowpea. 
It's not the quality of the so-called black man. Right. Eating bush meat and causing pandemics like Ebola. Right. It's not the culture of the so-called black man. Right. right. Native Indian man and Hispanic man. Right. It is time that we wake up because your Christian leaders have taught you enough lies. Right. right. Your Christian leaders have taught you to walk on cherry to the most high power. Right. right. Your Christian leaders have taught you to walk according to the flesh, to walk according to this age and according to the society. Right. right. All right, give me the book of 2 Corinthians chapter 10 and verse 3. Because we're going to show you so-called black man that your religious leaders have perpetuated continuous lies to the nation of Israel, the so-called blacks, Native Indians, and Hispanics today. Right. All right, read from verse 3. Turn on God. The book of 2 Corinthians, chapter 10, and verse 3. For though we walk in the flesh, so now the scriptures are saying to you, so called black man, for though we walk in the flesh, we must be in flesh to move, up, move around on the earth. Read on. We do not war after the flesh. We do not war after the flesh, so called black man. So when you see all these marches in Port of Spain, the LBGT, and all these other groups, we, the so-called black men, native Indians and Hispanics, we, the children of Israel, we do not war according to the flesh. These moves and these marches and these groups and these fake Israelite groups are warring according to the flesh, so called right. black man, That's because right. your most high power have never shown you that marching have ever brought us out of the condition that we suffered under the hands of other races. That's right. right. All right. How we war? We war according to the words of the Most High Power, which is to separate from all nations of the earth. Right. To gather yourself together, so-called black man. Right. Stand with your brothers. Right. Stand with your sisters, so-called black man. Right. Serve your God and your power. Right. That is how we war, not according to the flesh. That's Read right. On. Verse four. For the weapons of our warfare are not carnal. So our forefathers have made us known that the weapons of our warfare, they are not carnal. The so-called black man, how we win wars? We win wars by coming back to our power, right. by serving our God, right. by no longer eating pork, crab, lobster, and shrimp, right. Right. by no longer running to the abortion clinics to right. take abortions and kill the babies of the so-called black man. Right. That's right. That is what we must understand, so-called black man. That's we right. fight by refusing to join the LGBTQ. Right. X, Y, and Z. Right. right. That is what the so-called black man must understand. Read on. But mighty through the power to the pulling down of strongholds. But it is mighty through the most high power for the pulling down of strongholds. When the so-called black man celebrates Christmas and Easter and birthdays and Mother's Days, we are walking according to the flesh. Right. But we must rise, so-called black man, rise and separate yourself from the customs of the heathen, so-called black man, That's right. Right. and serve your God. Right. Right. Refuse to celebrate Christmas and Halloween and Easter, so-called black man, right. Right. and learn the principles of your forefathers, right. 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 which is to love your neighbors yourself. Right. All these celebrations that we celebrate are wicked celebrations, so-called right. black man. Right. Learn to honor the Most High. Learn to celebrate feast days and high holy days that is of the Most High power. Right. right. Our culture is when we celebrate holiday uh, Salakia. Our culture is when we celebrate feast days. What we do? We honor our God. Right. We honor our power. Right. right. We honor the Most High in all things that we do. So called black man. Right. That is the culture and that is the heritage that was left for us by our forefathers, so-called black man. Right. All right, read on. Verse 5, casting down imaginations. Doing what? Casting down imaginations. And the ISUPK, under commanding General Lehana, we were sent and authorized by him to cast down imaginations, so-called right. black man. Your imagination of Santa Claus coming into a chimney to give toys to your children. Right. right. That is a wicked thing to lie to your children, so called right. black man. Right. right. Because you know that it is you that is putting toys and giving toys to your children, so called black man. Right. But you know what you turn and do? You turn and you lie and say 
that is the white man that have oppressed you, that has given toys to your children, breaking down your family, making your children see the so-called white man here and the oppressor as God. That's right. When there is only one God, right, the most high power. That's right. right. All right. You know, casting down imaginations and every high thing that exalted itself against the knowledge of the power and casting down and casting down every high thing that exalted itself against the knowledge of the most high power casting down every high thing cast down believing that you you are rasta cast down that high imagination black man right. believing that you are muslim right, right. casting down so-called black man believing that you are Pentecostal and a Catholic so-called black man. Right. Right. These things are high imaginations that exalt itself above the knowledge of God. Right. Because what the scriptures have told you so-called black man, these things are not your culture. Right. These things so-called black man are not your heritage. You have a God, so-called black man, and you have a power that shows you according to the scriptures that these are not your customs. Right. Your so-called our uh, customs black man is to have braids in your hair. Right. Not ras. Your custom so-called black man is not to walk about and say you is a Muslim. Right. That was started by the Arab so-called black man. Right. You are an Israelite according to the Bible. That's right. Wake up so-called black man and learn your heritage. Learn your identity so-called black man. Come out of the wicked Christian church so-called black man. You are not a Pentecostal so-called black man. That's right. You are not a Catholic so-called black man right. that rapes thousands of innocent children year after year that molests 85% of the molestation takes place in the Christian church right. Right. that is not your culture so-called black man that's right wake up and know who you are right in the book of Deuteronomy chapter 28 and verse 64 it says to the so-called black man that you are going to serve gods that neither you nor your fathers have known so-called black man you can imagine today that your forefathers Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob was walking around with a Christian cross around their neck, walking around a stone, pretending to be Muslims. Wake up, so-called black man. These are curses from separating from your God and your power. Right. You know? right. And bringing into captivity every thought to the obedience of Christ. And the so-called black man must bring into captivity every thought that ex Salakia, every thought to the obedience of Christ. Right. All the things that you think and all the things that you feel That's that you right. should do, that you believe pleases God, bring these things to the obedience of Christ. Right. Which means to bring it to the obedience according to the scriptures. Right. right. Learn to love your neighbor. Right. Which is another black man. Learn to love your wife, so called black man, or wives. And black woman learn to know and learn to understand that the black man is the head of the home. Right. right. It is time to wake up, so-called black man. It is time for black families to understand who they are right. according to the Bible. Right. We don't. Turn on God. Verse six. And having in readiness. And having what? In readiness. And having in readiness, so-called black man. We don't. To avenge all disobedience when your obedience is fulfilled. And be ready. Be in readiness, so-called black man, to bring all things into obedience. That's right. When your obedience is fulfilled, so-called black man, so now you won't be running to eat pork, crab, love, sand, shrimp, and fall in prey to diseases and sicknesses, whichever way, all over the world. Glaucoma, cataract, goat, sugar, diabetes, cancer, and the list goes on, so-called black man. Right. Bring your mind and bring your spirit under obedience by separating yourself from the knowledge that belongs to the heathen nations. Right. But the so-called black man must understand that life and death facing the so-called black man, whether it be life or death, you need to turn to the scriptures to understand what has taken place with this nation of people today. Yeah. Understand what has taken place with the Venezuelans, understand what has taken place in Silox and in Junjun and in Lavantel today by coming to the records of your forefather, so-called black man. Right. 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 The book of Deuteronomy, chapter 29 
and verse 28, and the Lord rooted them out of their land in anger and in wrath. Right. So that's now is the same situation that the so-called black man, native Indian man, and Hispanic man is in today. The Most High rooted us out of our land. And where is our land, so-called black man? Where you belong to is Jerusalem, so-called black man. That's right. Not Africa. Right. right. You are not an African. Right. right. You don't eat bush meat and right. scar up all over your flesh, so-called black man. Right. The Most High have not chosen that for you. That's right. right. You don't? Right. And the Lord rooted them out in the, of their land in anger and in wrath and in great indignation and cast and in great indignation and cast them into another land. And what he did? Cast them into another land. And the most I cast the so-called black man, native Indian man, and Hispanic man into another land. That is why the so-called black man is in Trinidad today. Right. That is why the so-called black man is in Jamaica, in America, in South America, in Cuba and so forth today. Because we were dragged out and we were cast into another land by the power of the Most High due to our disobedience, so-called black man. And it's time that we return and gather ourselves together and know who we are. As it is this day. As it what? As it is this day. And this happened to us in the past and even as it is this day, so-called black man. Because right. the so-called black man, native Indian man and Hispanic man, must understand that there is power in coming together with your people and separating from the other nations. If you're even watching the wild so-called black man, if a zebra is in danger, what does the zebra do? Go and run among the lions? No, that zebra will turn and run among his own. That's right. right. And it's time for the so-called black man to understand it is time for you to unite once again and fall in love once again with your people. Right. 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 It is time for the so-called black man to fall in love once again with his black woman. Right. 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 That is what the so-called black man must understand today. Stop running on all these Hellenic nations and all these Hellenic women and love your black woman so-called. Right. Black That's man. right. That is what is going to build your nation. That is what is going to build your family, so-called black man, by loving your black woman, so-called black man. That's right. right! Because this is the will of the Most High Power. He said, do not give your son into marriages to other nations. Right. Neither take their daughters into marriages with you, so-called black man. That's right. These things that the so-called black man partake in yeah, yeah, yeah. by following these Christian leaders, these things are abominations to the Most High Power. Right. That's right. And it's time for us to return to the laws of God. It is time for us to understand the spirit of the Most High Power. As, we, as they say in the Christian church, I will serve God in spirit and in truth. Right. But then if you want to serve God in spirit and in truth, then you must do what? Love what God loves right. and hate what God hates. That's right. right. Book of First Ashes, chapter 9 and verse 9. And do His will and separate yourselves from the heathen of the land. Right. So the so-called black man must understand the pastors love to talk about the will of God. But God is going to make you understand what is doing His will. Read it again. The book of First Ashes, chapter 9 and verse 9. And do His will. And do what? And do His will. It is time for the so-called black man, native Indian man, and Hispanic man to do the will of the most high power. Right. Let us hear what that will is. Read on. And separate yourselves from the heathen. And do what? And separate yourselves from the heathen. And separate yourself, so-called black man, from the heathen. Right. Separate yourself from celebrating their holidays, so-called black man. Right. 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 Separate yourself from following their culture. Right. And their way of doing things. Right. And join with your people, so-called black man. Right. In the ISUPK. Right. right. Here is where you're going to find the leader of all black people on the planet. That's in right. the ISUPK. That's commanding right. General Yahana. Right. 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 And, and from the strange woman. Read again. And do as well and separate yourselves right. from the heathen of the land separate from the heathen of the land and from the strange woman and do what? And from the and strange separate. woman and separate right. from the strange woman so-called black man our forefathers 
For example, King Solomon felt prey. And the scriptures tell you that the things that were written above time were written for our learning. And our King Solomon, our forefather, one of our forefathers, felt prey to marrying strange women. And it is time for the so-called black man to see these things from before time and learn, hey, it is high time that I love my black woman. Right. That's it right. Is high, it is high time that I love from within my family, right. the Native right. Indian women and the Hispanic women. Right. right. It is time for the so-called black man no longer to take his strength and give it to the other races. That's right. 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 As you make it, you marry an East Indian woman. As you make it, you marry a Chinese woman. That's right. And given your strength and your bloodline and your offspring, injecting that into another race of people. Right, right. That is an abomination to the Most High. Right. right. And if any one of our people had not known, that is what caused the flood in the scriptures. Right. right. That's right. The sons of God marrying the daughters of men. That's right. And it's time for the so called black man to learn of their culture, which right. is recorded in the scriptures. That's, That's right. right. In a street, them bad. Gun talking up with jeans, member. If any somebody ever treat them bad, send the post to them, but meet them, God. Louis V kicks, pun we feed them bad. Catch a new drip, dub, we beat them bad. Look how we just come, we a beat them bad. You know, sister, we use them bad. Hey, but anyway, though, this are no playground. The Glock 19, they have to stay wrong. Now nah, take no check with me payroll. Anything rise up, play down. They must send check, but they won't. Dark, we will make it step if they don't. But at the same old, same old. Said them want smoke, but the grabber don't flame out. A couple of yalla come to. Yalla WhatsApp, what she gonna come to? She a give me tap and she swallow some jaws. Yalla suck cock till me Jonathan blow. Bentley van a come to. Convert to the drop top, still have a sunroof. The dark, them rules, chop your one proof. Alright, wanna move, wanna move. Anyway, my dogs go in the street, them bad. Gun talking out with jeans, member. If any somebody ever treat them bad, send the post to them for me.